Hey, uh, thanks for tuning in. Uh, this is my new antenna. It's an MFJ 2990. And uh, here comes my dog. He's uh, he's interested too. So anyways, um, just to give you a little breakdown on what's going on here, uh, this is a 43-foot um, non-resident uh, antenna. Not sure if that makes a big deal or not to some, but um, I was looking for an option that was going to be uh, simple and easy for me to install. So anyways, um, comes in a pretty big box. It's over, uh, definitely over six feet. So you get multiple uh, pieces. There are still a few pieces inside these tubes. I'm just slowly putting this together. Um, this is kind of the main part of the whole deal. So the big pipe, uh, I think it's like two inches. Um, they give you these plastic uh, insulators and it's basically just some PVC pipe they cut. Um, and you just basically clamp it on down. That's all you do. They give you a little ground wire here. It's pretty dinky, not gonna lie. And actually this plate looks like it's for like a fold down, uh, but that's the plate they gave me. And basically um, your coax just goes right in there and these clamps, I guess that's just the, uh, the way that this antenna conducts itself. Kind of uh, interesting. Um, those are flathead or eight millimeter wrench. And um, on the U, the U bolts, um, that's 13 millimeters. Uh, so all you need is either a flathead, eight millimeter, or a 13 millimeter, and basically you can put this together. Uh, that's a Phillips head. And those are just like self-tightening uh, nuts, so you don't even need a pair of pliers to even hold that. It's an interesting antenna, to say the least. Um, they give you a bag of clamps. And I guess you basically put two clamps at each uh, joint. Um, there's a bunch of pipes in here, multiple sections. Um, the directions are very, very vague. So there's diagram one. And there's the second diagram. Um, all the other diagrams are for other things, um, basically building the antenna. Diagram one, which shows two clamps. And then the second one basically shows you the insulator one, two, clamp it, clamp it. And then uh, the other clamps will be for your uh, mounting. Um, so to kind of get to the mounting part, on the other side here, however you want to do it, basically drive a uh, four, six, eight, ten foot mass pipe into the ground and then just clamp it. Um, I guess that gives you your ground. Um, you're not supposed to have to put any radials on this, but you know, I'm sure people have. Uh, this is basically a plug and play. Uh, this whole system is for my new Yezu, and I just wanted an antenna that I could basically uh, use all the bands with, and came up with this one. So anyways, uh, stay tuned for the uh, rest of this video. This is part one, and yeah, we'll start putting it together. All right, thanks.